Oh, shoot. Ah! <sighs> There's a spider up here. What's wrong with this picture? I'm naked. That's right, I'm naked. <sighs> so what happened? I was down, I was down my little villager area, trying to farm up some stuff. Hey, hey, hi buddy. Uh, trying to farm up some stuff and, uh, no, I wanna go here. Uh, trying to farm up some stuff to make some emeralds. Oh, hey, look. I've started trying to do some decoration in here because it was super boring. and I don't know if I like this, but I, I think I do. I need to do the roof, but that's going to cause a problem here. <sighs> I have to figure that out. But secondary importance. So I was there and... Turn the game sounds a bit... Um, and uh, I was AFK waiting for, you know, crops to grow, that kind of thing. And uh, I switched back over after a little bit of time, and guess what? I'm dead. Got killed by a zombie. Um, I do occasionally have problems with zombies spawning. Not zombies in particular, but zombies seem to be the most common. But I occasionally get a zombie will wander in from somewhere. And I don't know exactly where, and it's really frustrating. And normally, I have a little AFK hole that I can lock myself into where it should prevent that from happening. And I got a little bit too complacent, and and I died. So, I lost all my stuff. And all my levels. I had over 150 some, I had like 154 levels or something insane like that. Uh... Which I'm now going to need in order to, uh, to you know, rebuild all my gear. I have some, uh, I have the armor and stuff. Like, I have diamond armor ready to go. But, you know, that's, without all the, the enchants on it, it's a little bit of a pain. Um, so, <sighs> the most frustrating part, I lost the Elytra. And I can't just whip up another one of those. Oh, hi, Magma Cube guy. And I don't have my weapons with me. I have a bow, which I will use. Oh, uh, collection platform. Yeah, very good. Um, let me show you something. This was what I was going to come on and, and sort of show, and I was going to be all happy about. I lowered this platform a hair, which I think I showed in the last time. And I do have a bow and some arrows. And if I'm not wearing armor, I have some enchant. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. And I have I have the armor that I used when I killed the dragon, which I might pull out and sort of spiff up. Why is there nobody over here except for you? Okay. Watch. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, I'm going to turn down the game sounds a little bit more. Um, instant chain reaction. I'm bogging down the server? Yeah, I guess so. Uh-oh. Am I going to be disconnected here? Things seem to be frozen. Wait for the disconnect. Okay. So. The spawning platform. They're falling down there. Instead of falling all the way down to the roof of the nether. Yep. And. Uh, by falling only the 26 blocks or so. Are you guys going to fall? There we go. Um. What happens, I think, is that uh, these guys are dying more quickly, allowing more pigmen to spawn in behind them more quickly, 
which is the key to sustaining the little chain reaction. Of course, we with the server lag here, that might not happen so much. Hi, look at that guy. Oh, yeah. A little Michael Jackson going on up there. So, uh, are these guys no longer upset at me? I don't know. We'll find out. What have I got to lose? Not much. Oh, and by the time I noticed that I was dead from the zombie, um, all my stuff had despawned, so I'm... I'm kind of kind of screwed. Ouch. So this will be a good test to see just how effective all this XP is because I haven't actually collected XP from this thing from zero. Look at this. May as well collect some gold while I'm at it. And normally, what I found was by doing, uh, holding a looting sword, the, the amount of gold and gold, uh, gold ingots that, uh, these guys drop goes up quite a bit. Um, but of course I don't have my looting sword because I have to rebuild it. But look at this. I've collected, I was up there, what, for a minute, a couple minutes, not long, and, and I already am up to 24 levels. I started with nothing, and that's only half of it, so let's get the rest of this here, and let's see what we get. We'll probably get 30 levels, I would think. Oh yeah, easy. So close. So close. I don't know why I'm picking up the zombie flash. Actually, the zombie flash will be useful for trading with the villagers. Because I'm going to need emeralds to buy all the books I need to replace my stuff. 35 levels. Come on. There we go. 36 levels. Not bad. So, yeah. So anyway, um, the biggest, uh, the biggest irritation, I mean, I can replace all the armor and everything, but the biggest irritation is that I lost the Elytra, and so I'm going to have to go find another end city to, uh, to raid and see if I can find another uh, another end ship. It's very it's very frustrating, as you could probably imagine. So, um, what am I doing here? So I'm going to do this. Uh, so I'm going to collect this and then I'm going to go back down to the scene of the incident and. Think. Yeah, we have some more gold. That's good. Three blocks. So I got three blocks of gold, and this was out the, without the looting sword. Three blocks of gold, and, uh, and thirty-six levels of experience. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Uh, one thing I was planning on doing today was to build my little drop shoots. Oh, did I just walk into that pile of sword? Oh. Goodness, I'm sorry. Yes, I did. That's annoying. So, yeah, I don't. I don't have my wings anymore. Very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. But it, you know, clearly my fault. So, so I should have. Uh, I should have been more careful. But there we go. Gold farm. Yeah, the the platform's helping quite a bit, and I get chain reactions pretty pretty regularly. They do occasionally die off, but it's not uh, it's not too bad until I get the collection system set up. It's still I'm still gonna have to come down periodically. So, all right, um, let me get out of here, and I will head on down and we'll see what our emerald situation looks like because that's the next big thing all right uh, see you in a little bit all right 
here we are in the farm area and I don't even remember entirely where I was standing I think I was back over here I think I was standing right back here so I was kind of central to all this stuff I don't know where where the zombie came from um yeah I, I don't know I used to have like a hole in the wall up here right and there were some caves up there that I thought maybe they were coming from um, I closed it back up this is all pretty well lit I mean like I think exceptionally well lit like excessively well lit maybe this let's see here no light 10 9 okay so there's a 9 there but that maybe maybe one of these spots I don't know very frustrating anyway and even if he spawned up here you have to have wandered on down all the way down here oh what's that 10 um all the way down here and found me and i just don't know it seems so weird but anyway um yeah so uh -huh. I rearranged things a bit here, so I've got I've been just getting lots of uh, lots of stuff, and I've got uh, zombie flesh galore here. Um, how are my chickens situation doing? Okay, so so yeah, I have thirteen blocks of emeralds. What is that? Ninety, hundred and seven, or or one seventeen, or something like that. Uh, which is not which is not great because I'm gonna need uh, so I have these guys labeled so like this is my biggest pain point right here my best sharpness book is a sharpness three for 39 so I think I'm gonna have to do some enchanting make a new sword and see if I can get an sharpness five enchant I, I don't know um, so Fortunately, I've got uh, power, see power four, so I'm gonna have to do like two of those. So that's like 54 books, 54 emeralds right there. That's half my emeralds just to get a power five book. <sighs> Very frustrating. But as I said, my own fault, so I'm not gonna complain too much. So I have to find some uh, clerics that will actually trade with me right now because they lock up on the flesh way too easily. Uh huh. See, like that. Come on, dude. Ah. Okay. And I don't have that many clerics at this point. So I don't know. I'm gonna have to work out my uh, my strategy here. I think these are pretty much all librarians up here. Yeah, they are. Okay. Whoa. Ouch. Okay, well, obviously it's going to take some investment to, uh, cleric. I came up with a scoring system for the clerics. So he's this guy here. This, uh, 8.33 is my best scoring cleric. <sighs> so I'm going to have to trade some other stuff with him in order to... Oh... That's a thought. No, that's probably not worth it. Anyway. Glowstone. I can always use Ender Pearls, although I can get them for free. Glowstone, one for three. Uh-huh. All right. Well, I'm up for some tedium here. Uh, put the glowstone away. I have glowstone down here, right? Yep. Yeah. I'm breaking it. Bane of arthropods. There. Okay. Well. This is going to be a mighty annoying. Um, I've got. Let's see here. I'm going to run out of room for the zombie flesh, but we need to empty it out so I can pick up some more 
emeralds from the farmer dudes um, and just start going along and regathering stuff it's a little frustrating I have some room down here so that's what I'm gonna be working on um, and you don't need to see it and I'm thinking an enchanting setup near the gold farm is probably a good idea so all right well that's uh that's what happened that's what's going on and I've got, I can harvest some of this again it looks like it all grew in while it, which is what I was waiting for so I'll have to go harvest this although I would like to do it with the help of something that uh, I will be releasing a video on um, either just before this one or just after but I'm gonna be doing a Minecraft science video on uh, on farming techniques so anyway uh, these are all half slabs zombie can't spawn up here and this is 10 12 14 this is all too well lit up so he couldn't have spawned up here he didn't spawn on here did he I wonder this is my little uh, cubby hole. I close these. Nothing can get at me. Not even the little babies. I don't know. Okay. Well, it's enough of that. So I'm going to, off camera, I'm going to do a lot of trading and see uh, how many emeralds I can build up. And, uh, and then start uh, buying up the books I need in order to replace my gear. And rebuild all that good stuff. Um... And then probably have to do some trips back and forth to the gold farm. Maybe bring a anvil up with me. But you don't need to see that because it's going to be super boring. And I'll probably just do it while I'm watching TV and not on. And figure out why the dogs are barking. So anyway, that's that. Um, just wanted to let you see that and then of course the end the end uh, I'm gonna have to find another end city get some more Elytra and go uh what else do I need to do oh and build my drop drop shafts and do that testing on the gold farm but whatever I wanted to show you the uh, the, the the improved the improvement in the gold farm with uh, actually putting in the collection platform and show you the fact that I died. I've now died eight times on the server, and I am all naked. So there you go. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. All right, bye.